Welcome back to the show. A touching story here. After walking through a cancer battle with her daughter, Essexville area resident Katie Mueller thought of an idea to help kids through treatments. She created handmade craft kits that we'll show you here in a moment that kids can play with and put together while waiting in the hospital. And she donated those kits to the McLaren Hospital System. The staff there saying those kits have been a huge hit for patients and their families. This morning we welcome McLaren Bay Region ER Manager Danielle Jean to talk more about this contribution and the big difference that it's making. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Yeah, thank you for coming in. You know, when you first heard about uh, this idea, kind of walk us through your initial impression and, and how this all worked out. Yeah, when, when Katie reached out and said that she had these craft kits that she wanted to donate for the uh, young patients of our community, we were ecstatic and very grateful for her. Um, this is a nonprofit that she does all on her own, um, the resources, the time, the energy she puts into it. We were absolutely grateful that she wanted to donate those to, to our facility, to our emergency departments, so that we could provide those for the patients in our community. That's and wonderful. they are absolutely very well received by the staff and by the patients. Well, you know, you work in a medical setting, even for uh, some adults, the hospital is intimidating, mm -hmm. but kind of talk about for kids even more so. Yeah. Um, the emergency situation for anybody is very stressful so when you add that stress to a child it can be magnified and that stress not only on them on the parents it's also on the medical team that is trying to provide that care for that patient so if we can provide these uh, craft kits for that child it helps alleviate that stress it provides a distraction to them and that distraction reduces their stress even a couple levels it reduces the stress all the way around and lets everybody focus on providing the care that they're there to get yeah so we're looking at some photos here of, of this is a variety of things. Can I talk about some of the items that she's given to you? There are a variety of crits that uh, craft kits that she has. Um, some of them are paper kits. Uh, there's even painting, wood crafts. There is just an endless opportunity of different creative opportunities for these children to distract themselves and they, they've all been very well received. Yeah, tell me more about that. Have you, ha you have probably been able to see firsthand just these kids lighting up. Tell me a little bit more about that. The kids love them. It, it's kind of like Christmas. You know, you give them that present in the morning to open up and you walk in. They're scared. They're terrified of what's going on, whether they're the patient, whether they're with mom and dad or another sibling, whoever they're there with. It, it's a scary situation. So when we walk in and we're able to provide that gift for them, that craft that they can work on and distract them from the scariness of what's going on, they're just, they're happy. They're relieved. And you can see the smile on their face. They just love it. It's, it's pure enjoyment for them. Well, and what does, you know, this the selflessness really mean to you personally to, to see someone take the time to put these together and, and give them to the hospital? Oh, I, words can't describe. I mean, it's just, it's amazing that she went through what she went through with her child and to see the benefit and the success that she had personally and the fact that she wanted to do this and she does this all, all on her own nonprofit to bring that joy and reduce that stress for patients in the community, people she doesn't know. Um, I just think it's amazing. It's wonderful. We're very appreciative, not only as the ER, as the whole hospital, as a whole organization. That we is very great. much appreciate, Katie. Well, well, then how does this in a way make your job a little easier? It makes our job easier just by making the patient's experience easier. It makes them more comfortable. It reduces their stress. Um, all of that combined, it, it just reduces their whole stress and the traumaticness of the situation that they're in. So, Well, I'm sure someone may be inspired watching today. So if someone mm -hmm. is interested in a similar donation, any advice or what they can do? Yeah, if, if anybody's interested in making a donation to the hospital, all they have to do is call the main number. It's on the main hospital page website as well. Um, feel free to give a call and they will direct you to the person in charge of taking those donations. Well, it's glad to see uh, mm -hmm. again how even one person, one family can make such a big impact and uh, I'm glad that everyone's happy all around. Yeah, no, absolutely. We love Katie. We appreciate her and the time and energy she puts into these crafts. Well, thank you so much for sharing that story. We appreciate it. Thank you.